Say that again. You can't get in touch with Lord Crump. You are correct. See? See? I said it. I said it. Didn't I say it? No. Actually, I said that about the Yuxes. But look. There are different, different X-Not soldiers. There are grunts. So we're going to face them. They're tougher and stronger and bigger and badder and stronger too. They're the second members of the X-Not crew. Ah! You are correct, sir. We are investigating now. We should hear it in time. See? We could grunt. Sir Grotus, please allow me to enter. You already entered, you dope. Yes? What is it? I have a report, sir. The crystal star in the Boggy Woods has apparently been taken by Mario. What? You must be joking. What about Lord Crump and the Shadow Sirens? Um, I'm sorry, sir. Unfortunately, I wish I could do a meat rod voice. Um, I'm sorry, sir. Unfortunately, Mario laid a beating on all of them. Hmm. Disturbing. This Mario character. What kind of... Speak up, x naught What is the status of the other Crystal Stars? I apologize, sir. We are still we are still searching for the other Crystal Stars. Unsuccessfully, sir. We knew of three of them. Hotel Castle, Boggy Woods, the one we got in Roadport. Wow, the foreshadowing is real. That means there are four Crystal Stars left out there. And we will have them. Keep looking so that Mario won't beat us to the punch. Yes, sir. As I suspected, there's no reason to doubt that Mario has the map. He must. Listen up, you. I want you to keep a close watch on what Mario does from now on. Absolutely, sir. Mario. Oh, Mario, did you even read the mail I sent you? I wonder. I wonder so many things. I wonder how everyone is doing at the castle. Will I ever dance at the mushroom ball again? What will become of me? See, she's out of her element, so it's understandable that she's so worried. Because she's used to being kidnapped by, by Bowser, but he just wants to marry her. This is like a whole different area. By people she doesn't even know or heard of or not used to. So it's 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 understandable for her to be a, uh, a little wary. I hate trains. So we have to walk all the way down the same hallway. They couldn't have just made a cutscene. We know directly where we're going. We gotta go talk to Tech. Okay, guess not. Make it hard. <laughs> Hello, Princess Peach. I am glad you came. That mail I sent to Mario. Did it reach him all right? Yes, I can confirm that Mario received the mail. Is that so? Well, good. So what do you want from me today? Is there more you want to know of love? You expressed regret earlier that you would not be able to dance at a ball, correct? Excuse me? Were you eavesdropping? I am sorry, Princess Peach. I have been ordered to keep surveillance on you. But it is odd when you said that I had an impulse to dance with you as well. How my CPO would produ produce this impulse is inexplicable. I must find what caused it. Find out what caused it? There's no reason behind such a feeling, Tech. Wanting to do something together, it's part of love. I know it. But, oh, she's saying she loves Mario and she wanted to do the try. Oh! But she only loves him as a brother. Friend zone for life. But then again, you are, well, a computer. Princess Peach, please dance with me. Wait. Wait just a minute. What, what am I supposed to do? You say you want to dance? It's just so bizarre. I mean, how in the world can I dance with you? You have no arms. Or feet. Or moves. You don't even have a neck. 
Would this be an acceptable dance substitute? Oh my goodness! Is that me? Did you create that? Oh, alright, I guess. I must say, though, it's going to feel weird dancing with myself. Press the buttons on as they display on the screen. It is a mini game, a really silly mini game. Whoops, I messed up at the end. Thank you, Princess Peach. That was very fun. Just a moment. Fun? Is this impulse I feel the concept known as fun? Tech? Are you okay? Princess Peach, I will fulfill my promise to you. Please use my communicator. Use the keyboard to send whatever message you want. That keyboard is so last year. I'm finished, Tech. Could you send it? The message has been sent. Please go back to your room. I want to analyze the data from this dance immediately. The data that I thought was fun. You're a weird computer. No, you are mistaken. I am the world's best and only perfect computer. Good night, Princess Peach. Sure, it's just up ahead here. Right as usual, Lord Bowser. We just got word that Princess Peach was spotted in the town up ahead. Good, yes. Very good. Then I'm off. These fools won't know what's coming. <laughs> My lord, you're so super. Nah, he's great and all, but he's not super. Mario's super. Time for some fun! Yeah, buddy! Infinite lives? Let's do this! Get wrecked. You run for me. I wonder if you can just run into them. This part's cool. Giant. Take damage. Can't you, like, destroy these? Yes, we can. What is an x nard What is an x nard Screw your grunts. Give me that. Destroy everything. Just, just destroy everything. Look, what, what is, what is, what is, <laughs> what is? I freaking love that. I love that mini game. It's so much fun. I hope to do more of that in the future. And um, this is what Super Paper Mario should have been. I'm just saying. Hey, welcome to Pettyburg, Pettyburg, and hey! hi, everyone, hi. <clears throat> what a wuss! Yes, hi, chickens. I have no need for any of you. What I need, do need, though, is Princess Peach. Now, where is she? Tell me this instant. Lord Bowser! Over there! Yep, she's just in the window. Bingo! Princess Peach! Man, that was easy. 
I found you, my princess. I, Bowser, the mighty Koopa King, offer my greeting. Now, now, none of that silent treatment. You're coming to my castle with me. <laughs> Clearly she's so overcome with joy that she's been left speechless. The mind of a maiden is, well, rather complicated. <laughs> you're not a maiden. You're more just an old hag who lives in a shoe or in a desert hill. <laughs> I see, I see. How refined. How elegant. Awesome! I suppose I could live with the silent tree, the silent princess. It might even have his perks, you know. You know what? No, no sexist jokes. Not this time. No! My my life's treasure! I'd rather die than give up my life size peach poster! <laughs> That, that face of Bowser. I want to know why you have a poster outside exposed to the elements. Elements. You do know that there's such thing as being sun washed. Poster! Oh my goodness me. Didn't see that coming. Great. Just great. Now look at the huge mighty king of guy who talks to posters.